Publishers have gotten excited about the power of push notifications to boost engagement and return traffic. Unlike email, which was once the most coveted customer engagement tool, a push notification is difficult to ignore, and it reaches your audience on a device that they use most for accessing content. Notifications are the primary way people are subscribing for content on mobile. But unlike email, open rates are much better in the 50 to 80% range. Hi, I'm Jamarco, and today we're gonna to be taking a look at how you can use push notifications to boost your engagement. Let's dive into some tips. Number one is choose a reliable push provider. At MobiLoud, we integrate with OneSignal for sending and tracking notifications. They provide a high scale, fast notification service for both web and mobile app notifications. Some alternatives are Firebase, LeanPlum, and PushBots. We've actually reviewed 10 notification providers for your site. And if you wanna take a look at that, take a look at the link in the description. Number two is develop an effective opt-in message. For web push notifications, there really isn't much choice on how that notification is displayed. Now this is how the opt-in message for push notifications will look. For Android apps, it is less of a worry as Android users are automatically opted in. As for iOS, this is true as well since iOS 11. Also, it's imperative that you make preference management easy. It should be simple and straightforward to both opt in and opt out. You should make it possible to choose what types of alerts your readers get. Now this adds added control and goes a long way toward building trust with your users. Now we follow this and other best practices with our app solution for publishers, MobiLoud. Now, number three is make push notifications timely. You don't want to send push notifications too often or users can start to get annoyed. An app that does a great job with this is the New York Times. They send out push notifications when news is actually breaking. They do a great job with this and they have an entire team dedicated to push alerts. Number four is use rich content. Mobile push notifications are a lot like SMS text messages. You can add videos to them, images, GIFs, emojis, and more. A study by Urban Airship actually showed that image push notifications have a 56% higher open rate, but be careful. Sometimes using rich content doesn't really add any extra value to the message you're trying to get across. For some messages, a plain text message could be more impactful than a pimped out push notification, as long as it clearly delivers a useful message. Number five is using activity data and segments to send targeted notifications. Using OneSignal, you can create automated message sequences to welcome new users and to re-engage inactive ones. You can use a number of criteria and conditions to identify users who haven't been using the app actively and to try to re-engage them. You just wanna create a new segment with the appropriate rules, then set up a new automated message. Number six is track the success of your push notifications. There are plenty of tools that you can use to analyze user behavior or discover what triggers outputs or declines in engagement. Try using Google Analytics along with OneSignal or your push notification provider. It's a good place to start in terms of learning about your audience. But it's not enough to know how many users received your push notifications. You also need to see click-through rates as it indicates if users are actually interested in more than just getting the highlights from your app. There are a handful of signs you should monitor to make sure that the push notifications that you're pushing out are actually effective. Now, you wanna monitor these. Number one is how many viewed the notification. Number two is how many clicked through. Number three is how many made a meaningful engagement with the content from the click. Number four is did anyone uninstall the app from their device completely as a result? By monitoring these points, you can tell a lot about the quality of your push notifications. This is about enhancing your user's experience. So monitor what works and make sure you're providing value to your users via push notifications. Thanks for watching this video. I hope you got some value out of it. And as always, my name is Jamarco and I will see you next time.